the emotional rush that you get during the chorus is everything. everyone, it's Garrison here and welcome back to the channel and today I'm super duper excited because I'll be checking out with y'all A Pink's latest drop of DND, the music video for an all and of course this is tied along to their 10th mini album titled Self. What a significant milestone slash achievement I've got to say double digits now when it comes to their mini albums and uh, yeah it, I know this is a cliche but oh how time flies when you're enjoying music by your favorite group such as a pink honestly i still stream a pink's music still to this day the likes of luv mr chu no 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 to more so their slower based tracks like evergreen eyes okay i get quite emotional when i hear those two particular slower paced tracks but staying on track here i only have seen the teaser picks for this brand new era i haven't seen any of the video based teasers it's been uh, quite some time since i checked out anything a pink related it was the chubbum uh copycat era that i enjoyed a lot in my k-pop binge video but hey enough talk let's just dive into dnd &D now all right so brought it up here dnd &D by a pink i got the english captions on and all let's go oh whoa wow the groove to the song already i love it okay hi young with verse one here Ooh, in the charong. Wow, I love the chords that are being played. Long sigh. Don't worry alone. Pick one, your color. Paint your frame. Ooh. Yo. I love this brighter concept and overall approach and sound by A Pink here. Well, that slinky guitar work. Happiness is more simple than you think. True. Man, the lyricism in this song is incredible. It's okay to be optimistic. The end now. So mad catchy. The emotional rush that you get during the chorus is everything. Oh, this bridge. I am sing it. On me. Build up with some muted drum, snare drum work here. Oh, wow. What's going on here? Yes, the vocal flourishes, the high notes, give it to us. Oh my goodness. Okay, not gonna lie, A-Pink got me a little 
emotional here, a little bit teary-eyed in a good way, because pretty much what the straight to the point message in this song is, as we're becoming adults, as we're growing throughout life, right? Don't lose yourself, as in don't lose your passions, don't lose your dream, don't you know also don't listen to others just enjoy yourself and you live your li your life like it's 22 live your life like it's 24 when you're doing activities there shouldn't be an age range you know what i'm saying like when you want to do something there shouldn't be an age range age range you're never too old to do what you love to enjoy or to try out new things no matter what career path you're in, you know, no matter what situation you may be in, try to be optimistic. There is always a tomorrow. And that that one line with the optimistic tomorrow, I think it was hot with Hyung or, or not. I'm going to have to double check there. Wow, that one line. So you got to give it everyone behind the scenes. What's surprising, uh, though, because I did see the track listing and who's behind the scenes additionally to the teaser picks. We don't have Black Eyed Pills sung this time around. As some of you know, Black Eyed Pills sung came through with A Pink's. A lot of classics, including, of course, their uh, previous release of uh, Dilemma and all. But this time around, we have Donke, which is a significant, significant uh, duo in the mix uh, here that has worked with the likes of N Mix's Dice, Mafia in the Morning by Itzy, Wadada by Kepler, uh, Anti-Fragile, by La Seraphim, even super meaningful songs that are po that have a positive message and has the right intentions. So you see what I'm getting uh, here? I love how this song is just so A-Pink in itself, yet it takes this modern, slight modern approach, but at the same time, right? It's very straight to the point. It's very straight to the point with, a, how should I say this? A dance pop track based influence in terms of direction and utilization of genres. And a good amount of influences coming from the likes of, I gotta say, synth funk and new disco in the mix. You hear a bit of disco strings. You hear... A lot of synth strings utilized in this um, to heighten our experience that I'm going to have to point out when we dive back into the song. One may see, sure, the arrangement is pretty standard, but no, not really. When we approach that bridge and then we get hit with an interlude that plays with us a little bit and then bring it back again for the explosive climax, the end all be all to the song. Like, come on, what's there not to love about D&D? Now, if there's an acronym behind D&D, let me know. Maybe it's day in, uh, day. Th there could be uh, different ways that we could perceive D&D as an acronym, or it's just a way to, you know, transition and with the lyrics and all. That's something catchy and earwormy to get our ears going and tingling and all. Let me bring up the song here again, and we're going to dive into the music video, point out some favorite scenes, favorite um, lyrics uh, here and moments, and also process of what's going on sonically in the song. So I'm going to bring it back up here. What's cool here? I love this first scene with Unji. It's your typical 9 to 5 kind of office here with the photocopier slash printer and it's a sad face on it and what it starts here very gloomy you know they take something that's from what is gloomy and brighten it up as the music video progresses so the overall direction to the music video was incredibly well thought so pr literally providing like sort of a storyline you know it's raining umbrella there's black and gray and white. A blank canvas. They did talk about. They did talk about painting your story in a way, right? That blank ca canvas with Namju. So that was a significant scene as well. Yeah. 
I love how they like have their different op occupations uh right so basically they're attacking the airborne at all ends you know whether in your the business side of things whether you're you're on you know the food and beverage side of things and at a diner or, or or whatnot you know it's like look up you know there's more to things in life <laughs> Show me more smiley face. Love the vocal layering, but the drag of some certain words like who, you know. Meeted drum kit work. And that's why I'm like sensing a little bit of that funky influence, that funk influence. Just a tad bit, you know, it's not like 110% this is future funk or you know any funk crazy funk based uh song it's pretty much uh all revolved around a pop dance beat track but with a little bit of funk influences i've got to say and do you know definitely sin strings here A funky bass guitar. Exactly. I feel like this is something to talk about quite a bit. It may seem straight to the point and simple. Trust yourself for who you are. And I think time and time again, there are moments in our life where we have downs and we have doubts in ourselves. That's one key thing. Never doubt yourself. Trust yourself for who you are and trust the process that you're going in. That process may not be so linear as you expected and it could take twists and turns but continue to trust yourself no matter what because when you doubt yourself you end up comparing yourself you end up you know going into a really bad rut and a really bad mindset that's not going to support you moving on in life i've learned that a lot okay so <laughs> Oh, the ad lib work, it's beautiful. You gotta give it to the likes of Unji coming through in the vocal department. The pre chorus, I love it. The layering. Or this is the piano or keyboard chords going on. The Antino. If your own way, find your way. Like you're 22. Just when you thought like it doesn't get even crazier, this bridge hits, starting off with Hayoung, I believe, right? When you're anxious about life, and then. Remember me, it was next to you. You know you'll be stronger. But ain't that true? Like, in a way, whether it's like following your favorite artist and them being consoling with you due to their music, and maybe it's their variety content as uh, well. They've been consoling throughout those good times and bad times throughout your life. And I can say in personal experience, A Pink has in there uh, for me with their music and their content in the early days i haven't been able to catch up on too much variety these days for all my groups because a lot of stuff going in the k-bop scene these days but in the process of becoming an adult it's okay to say you're lost it's okay to be like hey i'm lost but Continue to find your way. I told you guys, remember that linear path. It's not going to be ever so linear as you thought initially, right, in life. Oh, graduate, go to school, do this, find a job, find a decent paying job, have a family. It's, it doesn't work like that, you know? <laughs> Just 
All of them are so glowing. What's really cool though, it's like certain two members would come through with like verse one, the pre chorus, and all. Yet, I love how they bring it all together all at once here. One thing I forgot to mention is after the bridge here. Right here, um, uh, this was an interlude to play with us to build up. It was in a way it's utilized as a brief pre chorus, if you think about it, to really build and, and heighten our experience for, you know, well, the final time around, last go around with the chorus. <laughs> the choreo is very fitting, too. Keep walking. Actually, what is that painting there? In a way... Having fun in the workplace. A flame. Ah. Your passion, your flame, your inner flame, don't leave it. See, this is what I, I love too, how the imagery plays out so well hand in hand, meshing together with the lyrics in this song. Like, come on, you gotta give it to the imagery and the lyricism in this song. Hey, they're 24, no matter what age. Wow, what a jam, a banger, and a half, but also such a meaningful one at the same time. I can't even imagine how the B-sides are going to play out. Probably going to end up doing a two-parter series. Going to have to see how many tracks there, there are. Uh, again, I can't recall uh, correctly right uh, now, but all in all, I got to say, guys, this is a 10 out of 10 for me, surprisingly enough. Right? Like, they have it all. What? Because I've said this time and time again, Having a great song, an amazing song is one thing, but if you're coming through with something meaningful, with good intentions, it just brings it to a whole another level, especially on a relatable standpoint. And I feel like pretty much all of ourselves can relate to this, you know, every step away and every point in our lives and all. So you got to give it to A-Pink, the production is there, the lyricism. The imagery, the overall direction in the music video, the directors and everyone behind the scenes, the gaffers, you got to give it to them and you got to give it to A-Pink. I think a lot of the members shined in their each and own respective parts. As you can tell, some of you guys can tell and know in the past before, okay, Hyung do be the bias, but I, I feel like uh, Chorong is really biased reckon me uh, during uh, this era on a side note I've got to uh, say as well as Unji but uh, let me know your thoughts about DND whether it's acronym wise or the meaning and such I love how it's straight to the point in terms of the message yet it's super duper meaningful but take care as always be sure to like share maybe subscribe as it helps out the channel so so much this has been garrison and see you in the album review whenever that's gonna uh, happen i'm sure that's gonna happen after i complete uh chasarang's uh, album review and maybe others we'll we'll find out together i'll try to do it as soon as possible guys i know I, i've been uh, lacking in the department for a pink as well but take care and peace